after the 15th Amendment had been passed, uh, those that believed in white nationalism, white superiority, uh, what they uh, began to do uh, during Reconstruction was they had to come up with some ways to keep these newly free persons from exercising their rights. And so the radical Republicans, and that's what they would call them, uh, radical Republicans, and you've heard someone talk about radical Democrats, they, they call them radical Republicans, this was the South. Uh, Republicans who really believed in the uh, 13, 14, 15 amendments, really the union, what they made the decision was that they would, in order to protect uh, the newly freed slaves' rights, they put in military rule, uh, there was a uh, federal troops presence in order to ensure, because remember, you cannot legislate someone's heart. If you think someone is three-fifths of a person, then what you're going to do is that you're going to try to keep them in that status. But the troops were there to protect uh, the uh, newly freed slaves. And so one of the things that the North was able to do is said that you have to ratify that 14th Amendment, which uh, guarantees full citizenship to the newly freed slaves. All right, when Reconstruction came, then a lot of the South had, was ruled where most of the state legislatures were controlled by African Americans. And you can imagine a, a racist or a nationalist, uh, they were very disappointed with that. And so, uh, but in the 1870s, 500,000 black men voted. You're probably saying, well, why didn't women vote? Remember that women were not, any women, black, brown, yellow, were not given the right to vote until 1920. Thus, this year, 2020, is the 100th birthday uh, celebration of women's rights to vote. But in 1870, no one could vote. But there were 500 black men who, uh, 500,000 black men that were voting. I think that number of half of these uh, were voting. Most of them voted for the party of Lincoln, and you know why. They, uh, a lot of people believe that Lincoln freed the slaves. That's what a lot of people believe. 